<laughs> I was at a place in my career, in my company, and in myself being to be open to tell a story. I think that when I started, I had very pure ideas of, of protection of a brand, of, of not, um, you know, compromising creatively. It was, every day was like an adventure. We didn't know who was gonna walk in the door, what level of amazing press moment would happen. Um, it, it was very exciting which editor in chief was coming in. Um, you know, major retailers from all around the world coming into my parents' living room. And, you know, retrospectively, the level of caliber of people at that time within the industry, it, it's kind of wild and outrageous. The American press went on a kill with, with our collection that we showed in Paris, you know, for different I'm reasons saying, yeah. with that show. Um, it was very difficult to put that show together. It was grueling. It was tough. Uh, and it wasn't well received. And it wasn't well received by the American press. By the Americans, okay. Yeah, just yeah. To this uh, clarity oh, there. Absolutely. No, they, there's absolutely. elements w and and many great reviews, but what gets recorded is the American press. But we had rebuilt our retail business. Uh, the licensing was back. I was on television. Uh, we were about to sign Brooks Brothers. Uh, you know, the business was on its feet, and. Uh, you know, we were supporting ourselves, and that's very rare in fashion. Uh, fashion, as I say in the movie, has lots of smoke and mirrors. It's a lot about the branding game. I'm as authentic, I, I'm just authentic and open, and I wanted to show that in this film, and I, I didn't want to be able to give anything, you know, other.